Good morning, everyone. We're here again with High Def Landscapes and Design. We have a wonderful opportunity today. We had um, a couple photo submittals from some of our clients, people we've done estimates for that didn't quite have the budgets. So we rounded together a lot of our friends, uh, family members, and kind of gave them a, a look over of their yard and their property and some things that we could do for them and came together, brought all the the friends and family here and this is what we came up with. Today we're going to be demoing out a backyard full of weeds, a backyard that has been by the previous homeowners neglected, left to kind of just grow wild uh, without any understanding of how to take care of their yard, how to maintain their yard, and how to prepare it for the winter seasons. So what we did is we came in here with um, a, a little bit of equipment and we demo out all the all the weeds, all the thistle, all the nasty things that grow in people's yards. So the first layer is going to go is after we've scraped everything out, we're going to come back with about six yards of topsoil, a biocompost mix that we get from our local distributors. Once we get that all spread out, we're going to have a few people out here raking, smoothing everything out, getting the leveling done, um, getting everything smooth ready. As you can see that it's quite a big yard and there's a lot of work that's going to have to go into this. So fortunately, we have a lot of good friends that really wanted to come out here and give us a hand because it's going to take a little while, but I think with this many people that it should get done pretty quick. But as we get everything raked out, we come back in with the pre-cut sod. There are eight squared sections of sod that we come in and lay in. They're all palleted out in the front and uh, wheelbarrows and people is what we got. All right, guys, here's a really fun piece that kind of randomly came together. As we were going through the yard, tearing out all the dirt, we happened to come across a bunch of these really nice pieces of flagstone. So something really fun that we guys came up with, instead of throwing away with all the other trash and garbage that we had, we decided to build a really fun walkway uh, from the center pit of their fire pit into their nice gazebo here. That really turned out really nice, easy to move. Um, you know, we had to cut some sod around it, but it ended up turning out really nice for something that was absolutely free and something totally random that we didn't expect. Here we are guys looking at uh, Rick and Jacqueline's manifold valve box. In this box we have a one piece hunter four zone manifold tees. Along with that we have our PGJ valves. Mixed in on the far left here we have our pressure regulator hunter pro series for the drip system that runs the entire length of the property for future planting and things we're going to throw back there. As you can see, everything's built right here in one box. We tried to make that a little bit more simple. Um, our lines here for the irrigation clock run here down to the length of the house into the garage where we have our Hunter Pro Series C remote box uh, for all their controls, everything they need to do for the backyard and the watering to change the schedules. We can do it as simple as using their cell phone and also uh, manual right there on the clock so they can program it as well as a rain sensor so as weather comes that the system knows to shut down when we hit a certain level and also allows them to program where they uh, want to water and what zones and what stations can be operating all at the same time. You can always come find us on highdeflandscapes.net. Uh, you can find us on Facebook, you can find us on Twitter, um, Instagram, and the World Wide Web of Google.